is Monday and I am ending off this vlog here. Well, actually, I'm gonna start the vlog here and then show you what I did the days before. <laughs> Let's go. Stop! Let's mommy stop. <laughs> Come! <laughs> I think I'm gonna make this a, a three-day vlog. Make that a four-day vlog. Um, I'm not sure if... If it's gonna be all that exciting um, I'm hanging out here in the girls room and I'm, I'm, I'm like I'm dying I'm exhausted so I'm just gonna I'm chill on the chair and <laughs> now I was literally wearing my wedding shoes at this point Yoni, huh? you want to show everybody what you're wearing? Huh? Yes, what you're wearing? Are you? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> are you? What do, What are you wearing? Are you wearing? Daddy shoes. Daddy shoes. And um, yeah, I am. I'm in Mocha. <laughs> I can't think with all the. Uh, the shoe is clapping and I don't have an appetite and my husband bought KFC the idea of KFC in my stomach is literally making me want to vomit <laughs> and cry at the same time because it's been wild the past few days um, the gastro going around is quite quite Hectic. My cousin's daughter was in hospital because of the because of the gastro um, that's going around at the moment, and um, I'm trying to stay out of the hospital and stuff like that. And I'm just exhausted, um, but I'm also mentally drained. Um, <clears throat> we went to. Odevier, not too long ago, like about a week ago. Eva, mommy's trying to make a video. Yeah. Mommy's trying to make a video. Okay. Say hello. Hello. Miss Lucia. Hello. <laughs> hello, Jake. Hello, you guys. person <laughs> but I'm failing horribly and it is it's <laughs> it's crazy how bad I feel um I got so angry today I think I've been like three three days I've I've had very little to nothing to eat and um Today I lost it and I just bought myself a burger. I might pay for it later. I might physically pay for the for it later with um, pain. But um, I'm drinking this apple juice. Mm -mm. Also, of late, I have become a super fan of <laughs> Pramas. I will admit, I think he's a little bit cute. Um, and yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a funny thing because um, my neighbor who moved away had a son who looked like Bruno Mars. And he was he's quite an adorable kid. And he was like, I think he was, he's, he's like 10 or 11 years old. And what he, <laughs> what he used to do was... Um, comb his hair in the same way Bruno did 
but now um, Bruno has changed his look quite a bit and he is now he released a song actually a day or so before no two days before the shoot of my husband's music video and um, on the Monday when we returned from the shoot I got home I opened my laptop and I was like mm, should I listen to another Bruno Mars song and then lo and behold a new one it was just like Ava Nova says mommy I don't want this lollipop I want a new one so um, there was a new music video and it's it's um, what's the thing called smoking out the window <laughs> I think the song wait let me just line this up as you can see in the background I am so sick I can't even get to the shop to replace the kitchen towel which anyway I'm about to sneeze so excuse me who of you have gotten YouTube premium I wonder if it's worthwhile anyway here goes nothing love Bruno Mars I think my kids just got home sidebar I don't think I'm married anymore <laughs> also jokes um, so my grandmother's ring needs to be my ring for the moment and um, this is also the ring I wore on my wedding day on my left hand so I don't get it twisted <laughs> Uh, uh, the things that I get up to, um, I legitimately had this ring on my left hand, so I didn't give, so I couldn't give the wrong hand when I eventually had to give my hand for the ring to be put on. So anyway, my ring cracked, and so it's in either for repairs or to be replaced. Um, uh, so not to be dramatic, but I want to die. This bitch got me paying over it, paying for trips, diamonds on her neck, diamonds on her wrist. And here I am all alone. all alone. I'm so cold, I'm so cold. You got me out here smoking out the window. Smoking out the window of the bezo, the bezo. Well, this is an empty tray. And this is where all the dishes are. My husband is gonna find himself in a little bout of trouble because I did ask for help. And when I was messed up and tired and ran down, somebody decided that they were gonna ask me if this dishes um, can stand over till the next day. Wat sê gewoon net vir my? Wie is die poepel wat die moet nou was? Good morning. So yeah, I just woke up. And I washed. Moisturized. I feel like I need a little bit more. Moisture. My lips are so freaking dry. But um, I just wanted to show you guys, I am still I'm back on the Himalaya. I'm use, I use the um, Venus wash and this works really well. I don't have any problems with it, it's, it's nice and cheap. Uh, okay, so I'm just gonna put on the Himalaya a little bit a little bit more of it on so, um, I like to use this kind of a tank with these brush thing so it really works well with myself and the kids um, but yeah anyway so after I drop the 
kids on. I mean, I'm feeling better today. So after I drop the kids, actually, I'm only dropping the one. So I'm gonna see how that goes. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to record any of that because um, my dad told me from the days that he's been dropping Nova, I mean Ava and Krish, because she's the only one that seems to be at the woods with the whole. Um, <laughs> so I brushed out the brush. Um, yeah, um, Nova's the only one that stays. So every morning when my dad drops off the kids, he's been doing me that solid and dropping off the kids because Lee works um, in Milton. So she was this. He is not working out. Fortunately, I'm going to the mom salon tomorrow. Noni? Huh? Say hello. Hello. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hello. Hmm. Okay, let's try. kids some tea I'm trying to get them off milk um because they've gotten this gastro thing for like twice in a row now well not consecutively not like sick and then sick again but like sick in a week break and then sick again so um what what I'm thinking is this is now an opportune time to get them off formula completely so that Ava and Nova are both forced to eat food properly. So um, yeah, but anyway, I just wanted to show you guys. I discovered this tea that was recommended by a colleague of mine. And she said that this is actually tea that helps with like um, sleep and things like that. So yeah, it assists with a restful sleep. So I'm gonna make I'm going to take one of these tea bags and then I'm going to put it in here and then I'm going to take normal rooibos and put it in there. Another one that I wanted to show you is the CBD by um, Anik and it is such a cool one. Um, yeah, no, it's, it's great for if you have anxiety, if you have inflammation, if you have stress, depression, um, if you need like peaceful sleep and stuff like that, this is the one to get. Um, there's a whole host of reasons why this one is great. This is definitely something I'm taking tonight. So, let me just make the tea. to me although it like the arms are flattering and I don't 
for the sake. Okay, so I got the shirt that I'm gonna wear tomorrow. Look at how this child looks. <laughs> but um, hashtag one minute eight low safe. Um, yeah, so I'm back from the shops. I'm back everything. I'm just trying on the shirt. <laughs> Okay, so this is the shirt tuck technique, and I had to do a voiceover because Ivanova was being completely busy and loud and stuff. So what you need to do here is um, leave the bottom two um, buttons open, and then take the bottom button, button it to the top button that's left open, and then do the same with the top one and the bottom on the other side like this and then you should end up with something that looks like like this so it won't be a hundred percent perfect okay let me just try this again i think i didn't do it properly okay so this looks like a half tuck kind of situation it's it's not perfect yet but what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna put in the two ends of the shirt, tuck it in, and then just straighten out the ends. And then this is basically what you end up with. I'm going to the red is in the red. I have no idea what I'm going to, what to expect and stuff like that. I don't know. So. And I'm not in the mood to, to be in a dress or anything like that. Okay, so um, I decided to put on a necklace that I've owned for years. Even before I had my kids. I think this is like my first magazine job that I wore this. Um, but anyway, so I'm just going to put this on over the shirt. Like that in. gonna do this and um, have it open a bit and then this would be like tuck, tuck that in and that in and it keeps the shape so Okay, so it is, it's Sunday and I'm on my way to meet, to meet my friends um, at the Radisson Red. The kids are with Oma and Opa and hubby is at home, he's at home with Gastro, so he's got everything he needs and I'm on my way. I decided to go for a very different look today. Um, it's here all flat iron, middle path, yo! I used to hate the middle path at school because this is the stuff people used to make fun of um, but goodness um, so anyway so this is the look and I'm wearing actually a pair of shorts but you'll see when I get there I'm gonna take some videos and um, yeah some footage so you guys can see what the Radisson Red looks like but I'm very late all I wanted to say was that um, you get up early as a mom before everybody to be five minutes to an hour late to where you need to be peace
Too much, too much, too much.